Hey, hey, what's up? And happy Friday, ladies. If you are watching this video, yes, I'm doing a video format because it just saved me so much time <laughs> instead of typing. So today you're going to watch a little quick video because I am about, I'm just really inspired to share uh, uh, my thoughts with you today. Um, you know, when it comes to marketing, every single one of us have a different way of approaching people. We have a different way of talking and describing what we do. And sometimes, you know, one person's marketing strategy doesn't work for you. And it's not because there's something, something that was wrong that you're doing. It just, it doesn't fit your personality. Like I know a lot of my intro, introverted friends, um, they don't enjoy necessarily doing these type of live or doing video because that's just not them, right? And there's nothing wrong with not doing live or not doing video. It's just not their personality type. And for me, I feel comfortable. I feel good about being on the camera and I feel like I, I'm okay to do a live anytime, any time of the day anywhere because I just enjoy that people moment where I can I get to connect with people um, so sometimes when you think about the marketing strategy that you're using I actually want you to dial back a little bit and think about what is your personality type are you someone who enjoy uh, engaging people in in literature in book club is it something that you enjoy talking to people at a at a coffee shop like what going back and think about what feels good and feel comfortable for you and how can you use that and leverage that method to get in front of more people. So maybe if you enjoy book club, join a book club, right? That's something that you feel comfortable about. And during those book club conversation, something will come up, something, because everyday people, we all have a lot of things that's going on in our life. So through those conversation, you will have the opportunity to learn more about the other person, not necessarily pitching them, right? Because that's not something that we wanted to do. During those conversation, you want to get in there and to be helpful. So in what ways, based on your own personality, like what do you enjoy doing the most and how can you leverage your interests, your personality type, the way that you've been talking and having conversation with your everyday friends, how can you leverage those moments and actually just show up and be helpful? And it, chances are people are going to be so attracted to you even without you noticing. People would be naturally drawn to you just because they like and enjoy your environment. They like your vibe. They want to be in your space. So that, my friend, is the most effective way of marketing. Okay, whether you do it on social media or whether you do it in the during in a networking event or book club, anything that you enjoy. Maybe it's outdoor. I one of my clients, and and I hope she's watching this. She enjoyed the outdoor, so she has a program that takes people to go to the outdoor and hike, and that's where she enjoys the most. So what is it that you enjoy on a daily basis that you can do it without even, like in your dream, in your sleep, you can do it, that's your marketing strategy. So I hope this clarifies some of the, you know, that, that uh, resistance of, do I really need to do like being on social media all the time? I don't like social media and that's okay. You don't have to be on social media, but what is it that you've been doing already that get you to talk to people like do, that, that would get you to have those conversations? You know, when it comes to marketing, the way that I like to see it is if there's any way that you can start having a conversation with people, that's your marketing right there. And because marketing is really about how you show up and how you show up is just having that conversation. And that conversation, once you get it going, I have no doubt that, you know, once they start booking a call with you, you're going to be so amazingly skillful that they want to sign up with you. But it is the first step of how do we get them to our call? And hopefully by the time they get to your call, they're already saying yes to you, right? They're already saying, yeah, Michelle, I really want to work with you. So that's the whole goal of being out there, being invisible, and also just talking about your business. You want to have that conversation. So where are you right now and how are you having that conversation? Hit the reply and let me know. Let me know if you like more videos like this so I can put in some time in creating these that will help you in your coaching business. Talk to you soon. Bye.